Hi, hello, namaste. This is your Shaker from DSM Academy. Today, I am back with very important video. This is for business statistics, fourth semester, Usmani University and all universities who is having this common uh, syllabus, business statistics. The topic is least square method. So, it is in unit number three, least square method. This sum will be 100%. It will be asked in the examination. So, I am going to solve this sum. And I'm going to tell you how to do this sum, right? So those who are new to my channel, please do like, subscribe and share. Look, in this video, I will solve the least square method ka sum kaisa solve karte, clear cut sum ja raho main aapko. So watch the whole video, watch karo, tabhi samaj mein aayega. And this video is the most important thing. Least square method, total sum, I will clear cut ka explanation is thana. So, under ki share the whole video. So let's begin. So uh, let's begin with least square method. So least square method is a method whereby which it is a most popularly used method. Ye bahut zada popular method hai, widely used method hai. Kyun use karte hai apan? Trend value malum karne ke liye. Future mein kya trend rahega? Future lame trend unto do dhan ki value calculate jayda ni ki mostly this least square method is used. So Let's see the formula how to calculate least square method. Here, least square, the trend of a particular year is equal to Na plus B of sigma x. So here A is equal to sigma y by n and this B is equal to sigma xy by sigma x square. So what we have to do is we have to see the years first. First we have to check which year is in middle. So least square method mein do type ke problem aayenge. Ek hai odd year moving, ek even year. So, first check karenge, it's odd or even. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7. 7 years. So, middle year is what? 1983. This is a middle year. So, this sum is related with odd year moving. Okay. So, the middle number is 0. Laga do. First, the middle number is 0. So, the middle number is 0. Odd or even is 0. This is odd year. In the first 3, here 3. And the middle number is 1993. So, then 85 value is 0. 1 bit quality. Right. So, now what we have to do minus 1 minus 2 minus 3 plus 1 plus 2 plus 3 okay next what we have to do is x square we have to do 3 into 3 9 2 2 is a 4 1 1 1 0 square 0 1 square 1 2 square 4 3 square 9 next what we have to do is we have to multiply x with y 77 into 3 231 minus 231 is the value okay so minus 231 okay 88 into 4 176 okay so next is 94 into 1 so here next is x into y 94 into 1 how much minus 94 88 into minus 2 how much minus 176 right so here 85 into 0 0 91 into plus 1 91 this will be in plus value okay beta? so I'll, i'm writing it clearly plus 91 and here 98 into 2 means how much one ninety six right okay 90 into 3, 270. So we have calculated xy value. So here x into y we have to calculate 77 into 3, 231. That to minus sign. So minus sign the 88 into 2, minus 176. 94 into minus 1, minus 94. 85 into 0, 80, 0. 91 plus uh, 91 into 1. 91, 98 into 2, 196, 90 into 3, 270. Okay, beta. Next, what we have to do is we have to total this, right? So, we have to calculate the totals. So, here, sigma y and sigma x, total here is 0. Why? Because minus 3, minus th plus 3, th uh, the total will be 0 here. And uh, for sigma x square and uh, for sigma xy, let's see the total. So, total of sigma xy is 623. Okay. The total of sigma x square here is 28. Okay. 
so 9 plus 1 10 14 14 14 28 next sigma xy total is how much sigma xy total 56 right why because this plus 270 plus 196 plus 91 minus 94 minus 176 minus 231 you will get 56 plus 56 understood so i am writing clearly sigma xy is equal to plus 56 right right we have calculated the totals next next what we have to do is we have to submit in the formula a is equal to sigma y by n okay so sigma y total is how much 623 so a is equal to 623 divided by n n is how what 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 7 numbers so 7 a is equal to 623 divided by 7 89 6 2 3 divided by 7 89 right so next uh, b we have to calculate b is equal to sigma xy by sigma x square so here sigma xy is how much beta 56 plus 56 56 divided by sigma x square is how much 28 so 28 b is equal to 2 so we got a value 89 b value 2 we'll substitute in that formula okay so year year trend for the year 1990 let's take example 1990 ka jo hai year trend find out karenge so in uh, n a plus b of sigma x right ye formula mein substitute karna hai formula substitute jayali year wise ka jadda first 1990 jadda so a a is how much beta 89 so 89 plus b value is how much 2 b value is 2 and here sigma x sigma x is how much for 1990 the x value is how much minus 3 so minus 3 we have to write here okay so 2 into 3 6 89 minus 6 83 so the for the year 1990 the value is how much 83 so you have to write in this trend 83 okay so next for the year 1991 so same 89 plus a value is 89 b value is 2 into sigma x sigma x for 1991 is how much minus 2 so minus 2 so here is how much 2 to is 4 89 minus 4 how much beta 85 up telling a 1992 values 1992 values a value in the 89 89 plus b value get hai 2 to sigma x so 1992 ka x value get hai minus 1 okay so 2 into 1 minus 2 89 minus 2 how much 87 next order wise 1993 a value is 89 plus b value is 2 and sigma x value is how much 0 okay so 2 into 0 0 so 89 plus 0 89 so if for the year 1994 the value is a value is 89 plus b value is 2 and sigma x is how much plus 1 so 2 into 1 2 89 plus 2 91 for the year 1995 89 is x a value plus b value is 2 and sigma x value is how much for 1995 plus 2 okay 2 to 4 89 plus 4 93 and for the year 1996 89 is a value plus b value is 2 and sigma x is how much plus 3 2, 3, 6, 89 plus 6, 95. So now write down this trend values here after 83. Next is 85, 87, 89, 91, 93, and 95. So these are the trend values which we have to calculate by using least square method. Agar for example, next year, ye tha odd year, even year moving is samjho. Even year moving me kya jata, next year, one year extra ho jata. Then middle me two values a jate. So one value should be taken as 0 0.5. Another value should be taken as 0 0.5. Minus 0 0.5, minus 1.5, minus 2.5, minus 3.5. In the same order, plus 2, 1.5, 2.5, 3.5. So next what we have to do, we have to multiply it with 2. You will get x. 
after that you have to make a square not immediately okay so if you are having any doubt you can comment i'll explain you uh, i'll clear your doubt so please do watch the entire videos then share to everyone nobody should fail your shaker signing off